Lou. Today we're going to learn about triac circuits again on UC210. Um, the previous video we showed you how to tell whether the actuator was good or bad. Uh, this time we're going to tell you with a light bulb trick of whether the UC210 is good or bad by doing a simple test here. So what I did is I have these two light bulbs I got from Kelly here that are 24 volts AC rated for that. And what I did is I took the 24 volts from the actual triac circuit and I put it to one side of the light bulb. So 24 volts is going on one side of this light bulb and then 24 volts is going on the other side of this light bulb. What I did was I took the open and closed leg, so here's the open leg, and then I have the closed leg and it's going on the other side to complete the path here. So when I try to open and close this, what you'll notice is the light bulb will come on um, if I try to open it and the light bulb will go uh, to the other one if I'm trying to open and close it. I'll show you that to you right now. I am going to go full open with this uh, actuator. So as you can see, the one light bulb lit up because we are trying to go one way uh, for the actuator here. So this is simulating this is going in the open position right now. If I go to the close it, it should switch to the other light bulb. And then of course, whenever the triax is not activated, none of the light bulbs should be on. So this is a good way to test whether the board is good or bad um, for your triax circuit. 